PSI precautions, PPP is, PPE is on. I'm looking for my general scene safety as well as a scene survey, just seeing what I see as I approach my patient. I have uh, gone through, see my one patient here sitting in a chair, there's be a young female clutching her chest. I'm going to determine if I need any additional resources, but I'm gonna, uh, I just have the one, so I want to make sure at least I've got ALS on the way. I don't see anything big, any need for C-spine precautions. I don't think so. She's just sitting here in a chair. I'm going to do a general impression of her. She looks to be maybe uh, having chest pain. She's clutching her chest. I'm going to quickly evaluate her skin signs, just how they look, see if they're pale, what color they are, if they're what the moisture level is, if there's any extra moisture. Maybe she's diaphoretic. I'm going to come up to my patient. Hi, ma'am. My name is Richard. I'm a parent EMT. What's going on today? My chest hurts. My chest hurts? Okay. So I know that she's talking to me, so I know her airway is at least clear. She's breathing. I'm going to check pulse really quick as I continue. Okay. Do you know where you're at right now? Yes. Okay. Where are you? Anaheim. What's Anaheim? Okay. What's the day today? Saturday. What year is it? 2025. Okay. What holiday did we just have? 4th of July. Okay, so I want to make sure she's alert and oriented times four, making sure everything's good there. Since she's still talking, I know she's breathing. I don't see any extra work of breathing, but she looks like she's taking some nice deep breaths at least. Uh, dive into with a, I know she's got a nice strong regular pulse right now. Dive into OPQRST, figure out what's going on. So when did this chest pain onset? When did it start? Mm, like two hours ago. Okay, does anything make it better or worse? No. All right, on a scale of 1 to 10, how bad does the, the pain hurt? Like a 7. Okay, where is the pain exactly? It's right here. Right there? Does the pain move anywhere? A little to my shoulder. To your shoulder, down your arm or anything? Mm -hmm. Up your neck? No. Anywhere else? No. Okay, what were you doing when it started? Making breakfast. Making breakfast, okay. So now I can also, I've got that pretty much all the way out of the way. I can dive into history. Do you have any history at all, medical history? Um, no. Okay, do you take any medications? Uh, aspirin sometimes. Okay, any other medications? No. Okay, and do you have any allergies? No. Okay, did you take your aspirin today? No. No, how much do you normally take? Just one of the white pills. A little one, is mm -hmm. it a tiny one? Yeah. Okay, is it baby aspirin? Yes. Do you take it daily? No. No, just here and there? Yes. Okay, when was the last time you ate or drank anything? Did you end up eating breakfast? Yes. Okay. All right, we'll double check the pulse again, just see if there's any irregularities. Anything, any other problems, that, anything else besides the chest pain? No. Okay, no shortest breath or anything? A little, it's hard to breathe a little bit. Okay, and what, that pain, what did it feel like? Like a, a sharp stabbing. Sharp stabbing pain, okay. Does it feel like the same down mm -hmm. your, into your it shoulder goes, and your arm? Yeah, down. Okay, arm stabbing, kind mm -hmm. of sharp pain in your arm, okay. Uh, we also want to check our vital signs so I could have uh, somebody, a partner, or um, if it's just verbalizing, we could request our vital signs. Um, I want to check my blood pressure, the pulse, a heart, a respiratory rate, and a pulse ox reading as well. I want to go through the systems and just check, make sure everything's good. There's no nausea, no vomiting, mm -hmm. no headache, any blurred vision. A little. A little? I think okay. so. You feel any palpitations ever? Yes. Yeah. Okay. At the same time, I'm gonna I'll end up listening to my lung sounds. Check my six fields on the back. I'll check my four on the front. Uh, we, at this point, we want to stay. She's gonna seem stable at this time, but we need ALS to get here with the, the cardiac monitor, so that way we can get a 12 lead EKG and get a picture of the heart. We're gonna reassess, get our vital signs, see what they are. We get her to the uh, into the ambulance. Do you take it? You don't have any nitro or anything. Uh, I, I might. My okay. doctor gave me a prescription that I don't know what it's for though. Okay. Do you know what the little, is it a little bottle? Mm-hmm. Is it a dark bottle? Yep. With a little metal cap? Yep. Okay. Well, we'll get blood pressure, see if we can assist them with the nitro, take it. Have you taken any today? today? No. Do you take any sexually enhancing drugs? No. No. Okay. These are all pertinent questions, especially in chest pain. So we'll get you in, I'd like to get you into my ambulance. Okay, we'll see what your oxygen saturation is, which is how much oxygen is in your blood. And then we'll look at getting you, uh, putting you on some oxygen. And sometimes that can help with some of the pain as well, okay? Okay. 
and then we'll just continue to reassess until paramedics get there, checking blood pressure. We can try and assist her with taking some aspirin, and if she can find it, nit her nitroglycerin to help with the pain. <laughs> Thank you.